HowToMakeAnything.com On HowToMakeAnything.com, today we're going to talk about how to transfer video from your camera to your computer as quickly as possible. Now, there are different kinds of medium you can record your video on. The oldest is videotape. This is a mini DV cassette. And if you're using a camera that uses a mini DV tape, then there's really not much you can do to speed up your transfer. You're going to hook your camera to your firewire, your firewire to your computer. Essentially, you're just going to play the video back into your capture program, and there's not much you can do to speed it up because it's turning the video here into a file and it can't speed up the tape. The camera only plays at one speed anyway, so I'm not sure how you would do that because it's uh, actually on the tape. Um, but nowadays, the trend is going to memory cards, like this 32 uh, gigabyte card right here, which will hold about two to two and a half hours of video, depending on what your setting is. Not bad compared to this 60 minute cassette. Of course, the cost here is different. This one costs probably five to six dollars and this is more like $30. However, this is good for one use, well, two or three uses if you record over, but that's about it. And this can be recorded on hundreds of times, maybe thousands. Um, it is definitely the future whether you're recording onto a hard drive or a memory card. I prefer memory cards, and this is why. Um, in your camera, where you put your memory card, there is a little slot that goes right here. That's where your, ca that's where your card lives and you record right onto that card depending on the settings of your camera. So you shot your video and you brought it back to your computer and your first inclination is probably, oh, just like my old tape camera, I'm going to hook up the camera uh, to my USB, which is uh, right here, I believe. Yes, that's the USB, this is HDMI, um, the USB, and go directly into your computer. And then you can trans transfer the video that way. Uh, this isn't the best way to do it because now you're depending on the speed of the electronics in your camera um, to send uh, the data from the card over to the computer and that's not the fastest way. This is usually a bottleneck in fact. Um, it's the slowest way to transfer video and since time is money and you want to probably, probably be doing something else other than waiting for your video to transfer, the best way is to take out your card and plug it directly into your computer. And there are a couple ways you can do this. Some uh, computers have SD slots or memory stick slots, depending on what your camera is using, or compact flashcard slots. Although I'm not uh, actually, most computers don't have compact flashcard slots. They just have the smaller media slots. Um, and if your computer doesn't have one, then you can get something like this. This is a USB card reader, and you just insert your card into the back right here. Insert this in into the USB port of your computer, and every computer has one nowadays and uh, you just read it that way. Um, the speed will be a lot greater if you just plug right into your, into your computer than trying to go through your camera. And it's really so fast to just take your card out, um, plug it into your computer, and then when you're done, pull it out and put it back into your camera. I mean, there's really no time loss, unlike a tape. I mean, tapes have to be jacked, and if you were even doing that with a tape, which you're not. Um, and so there you go. Just pull the card out and plug it into your computer. If you don't have an SD slot and then get a, a, a US, an SD to USB adapter. They're pretty inexpensive, probably around $10. And uh, that's how you make your video travel faster from camera to computer. This is howtomakeanything.com. Check us out.